When asked about God, Stephen Hawking had a very simple answer. In his final book, Hawking stated, There is no God, appreciating the universe's design and dismissing heaven or afterlife, using God metaphorically for understanding physics. Stephen Hawking clarified his use of God as non-deity, shifting to scientific language. By the Grand Design, 2010, he argued gravity allows the universe to self-create, abandoning symbolic religious language for evidence-based explanations. Hawking argued physics laws need no divine role, defining them as self-sufficient. In brief answers, he emphasized these laws suffice for existence, dismissing the need for a god to initiate creation. Stephen Hawking rejected a personal god, emphasizing science relies on logic, not divine power. He dismissed heaven as a fairy tale, viewing consciousness as fading when the brain fails, with no soul entering an afterlife, aligning his beliefs with scientific principles over religious faith. Hawking equated his views with Occam's razor, asserting the simplest explanation is there is no God. He appreciated life's grand design, urging to look up at the stars, emphasizing nature's laws over supernatural beliefs.